this book is called Red Hood Outlaw, Requiem for an Archer. In this book, we see Jason Todd going from his old look with the helmet to his new one, with the mask and the hood. I prefer the I prefer the actual red hood as with the with the helmet. I think he looks better that way. But in this story, we see him and Roy track across the country to help people. And then he strikes out on his own for a reason. It shows him missing Bizarro and um, Artemis. He meets up with his brothers different times. His um, adopted father, Bruce Wayne. It's really interesting. The storyline is really good, and then you see at the end where it, it meshes into the green, the the Red Hoods the series. But here's some concept art: the old look, the new. He doesn't really use guns much anymore. He uses a tire iron and a actual um, crowbar. And there's a close-up of Jason's head there. And there's the emblems. And then how they came up with the design. And then the Flores family, which, if you remember the heavy set lady that was in um, the Red Hood, Red, Red Hood, Red Arrow series, and the Red Hood and the Outlaws, named Susie. These are her sisters. And then there's more concept art for the cover, and the different comic books that were in the series. So check that out. You'll enjoy it if you really like the Red Hood. This series was really good. Follow them through America, through other countries and see what happens when he loses someone close to him what happens to him check it out